hello welcome back to engineering sound in this video tutorial i will explain page setup and page layout setting with very details suppose we have here model and layout how we can do a proper setup of our layout in autocad or autocad civil 3d we have this drawing we need to delete this viewport from here you can just uh, select it and you can click delete button from your keyboard okay let's go to right click and go to the page setup manager from here and you can see here page setup manager okay you will select this option and the next you will go to the modify option and from here you need to do some basic settings like suppose we need to select here from here the mono option okay just select this one and here you need to select your printers i am selecting dwg to pdf because i want to create a pdf file of the drawing and here is mono okay and from here you need to select one and one and here one and one option okay and here is layout and from here you need to select the paper size i am going to select iso a2 5 194 multiply 420 mm i'm going to select this one okay and change this option here okay this is my page it's up to you which paper size is required to you or your client you can select it as per your requirement okay click on ok button and close now your page setup is complete okay next we need to go to again to the page setup manager and we will do modify and we will go to the properties okay from here we will select the properties here is the option modify standard paper size okay we need to select this option here and we will go to select the paper which we already selected and the first portion okay select it from here iso a2 okay this one option yes this is you can see this is the same paper and go to next to the modify option from here click on modify okay this is the same paper and we will select on modify okay click here you can see the top bottom left right margin you can see this is our margin custom paper size okay five five and we will change it here okay next okay and here we will go to open calculator we will do some calculation okay our page size is here okay 594 okay 594 and 420 and we will we will subtract this from these two option 5 and 5 mean 10 millimeter we will subtract and from 420 we will subtract 17 and 17 okay top bottom and side edges margin we will subtract it from the page size okay here is the practical example okay 5 194 subtract 5 okay subtract 5 minus 5 and minus 5 okay here is again 5 we will subtract 2 times 5 okay so this is 584 okay remember this digit and the next we will go to subtract for from 420 okay 420 and we will minus 17 and 17 two times 17 okay 17 minus again 17 okay this is 386 okay now we have two different digit without margin we will go here and we will click a viewport okay close and now we will create 
a view port okay enter m view m v okay and here with the m v we will enter 0 comma 0 so that's it will start from the zero corner click m v okay enter this is the mv command for viewport to creating and we will enter 0 comma 0 so it will start from the zero point okay you can see here it's automatically start and now we will enter the value which we created before and in calculation the first value is 584 comma 386 this is the value without margin okay click enter now you can see your viewport is 100 percent fix and created i hope this video is helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe we will see in the next tutorial goodbye take care